What's up, it's Augie. I usually don't do a lot of YouTube videos, but today is a special day. I am going to Union Square to busk or street perform with a really, really cool artist. So I wanted to take you guys for the journey. So we're gonna find out how much money we could make street performing with a major pop star. And what we're gonna do after is we're gonna donate that money to a charity. That is my personal info. Let's do it. All right, let's do it. I don't really know where our mystery person is setting up, but uh, hopefully we'll, we'll find him. We'll find him somewhere. If not, his performance will probably be better. So he's probably hoping, right, he's probably hiding right now. <laughs> and I hope that sass player <laughs> can't find me. We'll just hear a performance from up in the trees. The real fun thing that Andy doesn't know, uh, uh, Andrew, you ever watch Toy Story? Yeah. Well, you're about to be real excited. Anyway, I'm actually gonna smash my saxophone at the end of this performance, <laughs> which is gonna be really cool. I was thinking of giving it to somebody, but you know, sometimes you just gotta give it to gravity. Think about how, how much time we spend defying gravity. <laughs> gravity wants to pull us all down, and we're over here just standing up and walking around and defying it. Every once in a while, gravity's gotta win. So I'll be donating this saxophone to gravity. <laughs> Where for Art Andrew? Maybe you're more towards the back of the park. Is that possible? Nah, nah, honey, I'm good. I mean, I'm just hoping he brings Woody and Buzz with him. I do everything wrong. I put, I leave the read on, and then wonder why after like three times of playing it, it doesn't work. It's because it's soggy. It's like soggy jello. It's like yeah, exactly. It's like if you put your grandma in a hot tub, right? Then you took her out and then immediately put her in a bag. Grandpa's not happy with you. Your mom is probably a little upset as her mother has now become a, a soggy glimpse of what she used to be. That's actually the name of my upcoming album. Soggy Glimpse by Soggy Jello. Hey, hey dude, what's going on, man? So great to meet you. Good to meet you, buddy. I'm super excited so you do to play. This bunch? Yeah, yeah, That's all the time. Yeah. Busting? Yep. Yep. It's a lot of fun. Hey, everybody. Thanks. How are you doing? Good. Yeah, thank you. What's your name? Hey, Johnny. How are you? Hey, Johnny. Thank you. Oh, my God. 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 Uh, if you don't know, the, I, this is how I started as a street performer. So what we're gonna do real quick to possibly get a bigger crowd is I'm just gonna um, I'm gonna smile at you on the count of three, and you're all gonna scream like I just did a triple backflip. Okay, one, two, three. Round of applause for Augie Bell on the freaking sax. So now, now, honey, I'm good. I can have another, but I probably should not. I got somebody at home. If I stay, I might not leave alone. I said, oh, are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure? This world's not mine. So, all right, we're gonna rock this out. Yeah. 
can sing with me and make as much obnoxious noise as possible, just on the O's and the A's. My first song that did all right, and I wrote it on the street, actually. It had been a full day of, like, not one person putting anything in it. But it had been a whole day of, like, eight hours of playing, and not, nobody, like, smiled at me or put a freaking anything in my little case here. And uh, I went home and wrote myself a little pick-me-up song. I actually first had a conversation with this guy. This is about 10, almost 10 years ago, maybe a little more. Like, it was a full day, fully ignored, and I packed up all my crap, and I looked up at this guy on the street like this, and I was like, your move, whatever's up there, because I'm never leaving. Like, I'm just going to keep doing this on the street until something works, so it's a little bit on whatever's up there. And I went home, and I sat down, and I wrote this song. So on the O's and the A's, if you'll get loud with me, that would make me happy and fully sweated. Here. But you gotta keep your head up. Oh, then you can let your head down. Hey, you gotta keep your head up. Oh, you can let your head down. Hey, now I know it's hard here. No, it's hard to remember sometimes. You gotta keep your head up. Oh, you can let your head down. Thanks for rocking me for a little bit. Yeah. 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 Super, super fun. fun. Yeah. I only felt like very this song. Thank you, dude. Thank you. Thank it's you. going well. Yeah, yeah, it's been fun. I, I've been actually oh able to do it a little less now. Which is, but, I guess, yeah. but I love when I get to it's do it. It's fun. It's really fun. That'd be fun. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it is. And then the sun, <laughs> as soon as you started, the sun the got sun brighter. <laughs> So we just finished up street performing. We made some money. Uh, we're gonna count it up and donate it to a charity for breast cancer. We're gonna look into which is a good one, of course. Um, but yeah, uh, super great to meet Andy Grammer. He's a super great songwriter, performer, and it's cool to meet someone who actually did street performing. Cause that's what I do. About. Shout out to Andrew. Andrew. So unfortunately the audio got corrupted in this video, but I'm happy to announce we made $51, which isn't bad, and uh, we're donating it to the American Cancer Society. The great thing about the American Cancer Society is they support breast cancer patients by providing rides to treatment, lodging during treatment, breast cancer support, hair loss, and mastectomy products. So uh, this is a really great foundation. I would advise you guys to check it out if you can. Donate what you can. Uh, thank you so, so much for watching this video. And if you want some more content like this, please let me know in the comments down below. See you guys later.